Hey, what's up guys, Zcox97 here, and I am in Fallout 3. Just started playing this game about a week ago, and uh, I'm about to go on a journey. I have been doing the missions for Mora, for those of you who have played this game, which I'm sure are plenty since this game's been out for 40 years. Uh, I've been doing the quests to make the book, and I'm on the final one. I've got to go to the Robco facility, a bunch of robots, and... Uh, you know, I think I think the best way to kill robots are energy, and I don't have a lot of energy, as you can see. Well, actually, that's not too bad, but, you know, big guns, I barely have anything in. It's going to be a little difficult to take on the armada that will come out of that facility. So, you know, let's just go. Oh, looked like that woman was trying to toss me a potato salad or something made from Kickstarter. So... Let's see, I'm in Megaton right now. I decided not to blow up the city. You know, spoiler alert, you can blow up the city. There's a bomb right there, the nuke, that you can use to blow it up. Kind of looks like uh, that thing from Call of Duty Zombies. I guess that's all, how all bombs look like. Excuse me. It's a weird-ass looking cow there. It's got two heads. Hello, civilians. Anything to say to me? Excuse me, can you look at me? Hello. I hope they let me buy a house here someday. Alright, I can't even hear what he's saying. I put down the volume so that I don't get echoes. So, you know, uh, something new. Never really play Fallout. Uh, I might not edit this video at all that much, really, because... I don't know. A lot of people like to watch, like, four-hour videos of people mining in Minecraft. I don't know how the hell... They find that entertaining. You know, personally, if I go into, like, a live stream or something, I'm done within about two minutes. Even if I like the person. Oh, this little guy needs some water. Hello, Mickey. Water. Where's your ears? Man, a lot of tough times happened after uh, Disneyland went down. Thank you, stranger. I hate to ask you this, but, but times are hard. Whoa, whoa, I saved anymore. your life, okay? The least you can do is at least give me a hand job or something. No, find your own oh. water. I guess that's understandable. Gotta watch out for numero uno and all. How dare you remind me of a very fun card game that I can't play while I'm in the wasteland. You are you are a despicable human being. You know what? I, I gotta I gotta deal with this man the way that we deal with uh, infected dogs in the outback. I'm gonna murder you, kind sir. Get out of here. Dare you try and tell me what to do. Lost karma, I don't care about karma. Karma don't exist. Am I going in the right direction? All right, there we go. Bottom left is telling me where to go. So let's see here. I got a let's let's check the map. I got a I got a long journey to go. Old map. There we go. So this is like the entire thing. I gotta travel about a continent's worth over there. Can I even fast travel there? That would be too easy. I'm just gonna walk there because I, I it reminds me of Lord of the Rings. You know, I'm Frodo and Sam at the same time. In fact, Sam is my shotgun because, you know, it's my best friend. And definitely the shotgun will be carrying me there. Uh, there's an enemy on my radar. Whoa! Oh, come on, a robot? Are you kidding me? I'm already running into them. I thought I would have to deal with them, you know, once I got there. But now I got to deal with them already. Let's see here. Zero percent to hit their combat inhibitor. You know what? I don't care about... Never tell me the odds. Okay, it's... it's Alright, it won't even let me choose. This game does not have a lot of freedom. Uh, I'm going to aim for the head. I got about a 34% chance, so let's fire off three shots. That, that means statistically one of them should hit. Alright, there we go. Missed. Alright, you know what? Two out of three ain't bad, just like Meatloaf taught me. Let's aim in closer. Boom, that's a nice head shot. As long as he keeps missing. Boom. Oh man, you're, you can't take any of this. Got to reload. You know what? I'm switching. I'm switching to the to my fire shish kebab. Whooshing! Oh, he is down for the count. Wow. You know, I'm gonna, I'm gonna get out some like meat or something. Make a campfire. Do I got any marshmallows? Aid. Blood pack. Some buff out. Um. Got some. Uh, you want some rat away? That looks. That looks like something you would eat. You know. Wait. I can, oh, I can't do that. Um, you know what, blood packs, the only thing I got that's remotely close to food, so I'm gonna drop it, there we go, oh, okay, the fire's out, maybe the blood put out the fire, alright, well, I'll eat that later, what do you got in here, energy cells, good, vision battery, gonna eat up all my weight, can still carry a good 200 more, what's that, oh, 
Oh wow, I chopped off its head. That's fantastic. So yeah, that's my uh, that's my exca this is my Excalibur. I pulled it out of the stone. It was on fire. In fact, that's how it got on fire. The friction of the metal and the rock. I was like a caveman discovering, you know, fire for the first time. Maybe that's how they discovered it. Maybe it wasn't lightning. Maybe they just found a sword in a stone, ripped it out, and then one of them was named King Arthur, and that's how the first, you know, government formed. Whew. So, this is going to be a long journey getting to the Robco facility. I don't even know what I'm supposed to do there. Like, once I get there, I, I, I assume I have to find something. Mora is a really nice person. She's kind of weird and annoying. But she's very friendly because a lot of people in this game aren't friendly. You know, back at Megaton, you know, I said I, I actually saved that town. Yeah, a lot of people couldn't care less because when I walk around and talk to people, when I can hear them, they, they're just like, I don't have time to talk. It's like, oh, yes, yes, I can see you're very busy walking around in the same pattern. Yes, yes, I just saved your town and you're just saying you don't have time to talk. Whoa, okay, that's all right. Didn't even realize people were attacking me. Uh, you know, I'm a, oh, ooh, ooh, wait, no, I want to mess up her accuracy. Just fire off, just got to cripple that arm. That's a rocket in midair. That's a rocket, just got hit with a rocket. Wow, I killed her in two hits. All right, there we go. Uh, don't like the odds of the head. Um, uh, not the missile launcher, because I actually want to sell that for money. Kind of, uh, wow, what, 62% and you're aiming for the clouds. What an idiot. Ooh, that was a good hit, though. One more hit. Ouch. Okay, they definitely hit me with that one. Did you kill a teammate? You killed your own teammate. You Did you just kill yourself? You know what? Aim for the head. You're down. Kapow. Oh, that is beautiful. Beautiful headshot on the raider. You killed your own teammate. You stole my XP. Nice tits. Okay, what do we got here? Caliber round. Pistol. Some of that. Some of that. Alright, definitely going to sell that later. I find it interesting how... I can't pick up the rest of their clothing, you know. I mean, it, maybe maybe people need underwear. You know, that might that might be worth a lot of money. Bottle caps, missiles. There we go. All right. Okay. Took those guys out. Not too bad. Just uh, one of the many obstacles along my journey to the Robco facility. It'll probably take us a good ten years to reach that place. That's a rad scorpion. That's that. I don't like these things. I don't think this gun even does damage against them. Does it do damage? It, I've missed. I, I guess it, it kind of does damage. Ooh, right on the claw. All right, let's just let's just let's just make a campfire out of it. Oh, that is awesome. All right, Rad Scorpion Poison Gland. I'll take it. Oh God! Oh God! Her mom came by. Mom's mad that I killed her son. Well, that's what happens when you fight with fire. Hey. Oh man, I'm actually hurt. I'm gonna. Let's see here. I got some. Stim packs, there we go. Eat some stim packs, make yourself healthy. Alright, gotta switch to the shotgun. That gotta switch. Oh my god, there's an entire army. Okay, I got way too many scorpions to deal with right now. Okay, come on. I'm gonna fire off three shotgun rounds. Oh, okay, not the shotgun, the other gun. That didn't do anything. Just 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 go in ham. Just go in ham. I don't have time. Just just drive Velma, just drive. Shotgun time. Oh wait, yo, wait, shotgun's down. Okay. Boom! Missed. Boom! There we go. Boom! Boom. 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 There we go. That was rough. That was a situation that led to a lot of death. That was a battle, as some would say. Where is the big mama? There's the big mama. She better give me something that is worth a lot of money. Four poison glands. That is amazing. I'll take it. Take it to the bank. Did I already, yep, I already searched this one. Is that a robot? What is that? Is that just like a rock? Huh. Let's, let's go, let's go explore a bit. What is this rock? Maybe this rock is hiding something from me? Hello? What? This is a strange looking rock. It's like a statue or something. That's interesting. Something on my radar. What? Is, another... <sighs> You know, I'm not fighting it. I can't I can't use up all my ammo. I need to save it for the robots. Maybe uh maybe Scorpion from Mortal Kombat will just leave me alone eventually. Is it still following me? Yep, still following me. Good thing I run faster than a speeding bullet. Just call me Batman. I always get weirded out when the cricket goes off. 
because in this game, if you run over a mine, it goes beep, 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 poof, and then blows up and really messes you bad. Um, and I always think the crickets is actually just the beep, beep, beep of the mine. What the hell is that creature? Let's zoom in. Mr. Gutsy. I guess it's a robot or something. Let's just fire off a couple rounds at it and see what it's got. Okay. That's... No. Alright, not worth it. Not worth it. That's gonna take way too much ammo. Just keep firing at me. You're gonna keep missing. Stupid idiot. Keep escaping. We can outrun him. There's like a castle up ahead. That's interesting. Alright, how much farther do we have to the Robco facility? Not too bad. We're about halfway there. Or a little over halfway there. About two-thirds. It's good. Oh yeah, that's Ten Penny Tower, I guess. That's the tower you go to to blow up Megaton. I did that. I saved my before I did it, though, just so that I could say I blew up Megaton. It's amazing how Mora actually survives the Megaton Blast. It was like the freakiest thing I've ever seen in a video game. Because in this game, there's these things called ghouls, in case you didn't know. It's basically people that are super radiated to the point where they're like zombies. They like Most of the time, they speak normally. Like, they're like normal. What the hell was that? They're like normal people, but they look completely messed up and like shredded and ugly. It's it's very scary. This thing's dead. That's amazing. But anyway, um, and so yeah, uh, and yeah, so this it's made from radiation, right? So more is like this nice person and all. I blew up the city and murdered everyone. Who a mole rat? That's an easy kill. And um, I ended up going back to the city just to like look at the ruins of it and I went there and out of nowhere my camera turns and it's Moira and she's like oh hey there that was a big blast and I was like what the hell and she's a ghoul she looks completely messed up her voice is the same which that doesn't make sense but she is completely ruined and I'm talking to her and she she doesn't fully understand that I blew up the city she just thinks like there was a big boom and she has a headache and she doesn't remember anything and I'm like yeah and I told her I blew up the city and she was like Haha, ha, you're funny. I was like, what? And, and, I, and I, I like went for the full effect. Like usually I'm a nice person when I play the video game. Yeah, not this time. I blew up the city. I decided I was a bad guy. So I was just telling her, yeah, you're ugly. Your skin's falling off. And she was like, oh, well, you know, you got to deal with things sometimes. Guess it's, uh, it'll pass. And, and I was like, she had the most positive attitude in the world. Like I wish I could have her attitude, you know. If my entire life was ruined, I wish I could be like that. Alright, so we reached the Robco facility. There we go.